Hi, I'm Chris Dowdy with Orange Star Networks, and I'd like to discuss a few important questions you should consider before purchasing a laptop. Probably the greatest factor you should think about before purchasing a laptop is how much money you're willing to spend. The more money you can spend, the greater features, number of features you can purchase on a laptop. However, if you're budget conscious, you may need to trade off some more less important features in order to save a few dollars. There are six factors or six questions I would consider when looking at a laptop. The first and foremost to me is the weight of the laptop. It may not make much difference now to carry around an eight pound laptop, but once you've been back and forth to school or back and forth to work or even traveled through an airport, you'll soon realize that the weight of the laptop will become a hindrance to you and it will affect your uh, comfort in using the laptop. Um, so if you can afford um, a more expensive laptop, generally you can afford a lighter laptop or a thinner laptop. Um, the second question I would ask myself is what size display do you need? Generally if you have a graphic intensive program or perhaps spreadsheet programs or database programs, you'll need a larger screen in order to view them comfortably. The larger the screen, however, and the brighter the screen, the more money that it will cost to get that feature. A uh, third consideration or question is what type of input are you comfortable with? Many people are accustomed to using a mouse but not so much with a touchpad or with a joystick button. If you're not comfortable with using those, you may consider trading off those features for an external mouse. Um, a fourth consideration is battery life, and this becomes important the longer you have the laptop. A lithium-ion battery will cost more money, but overall it will give you a longer battery life and less time between charging. Uh, on the other hand, a nickel metal hydride battery, although it's cheaper, will require more charging and over time it will become uh, less and less of a charge on the laptop and you'll, meet, you'll need to recharge it even more frequently. The fifth consideration is, is a display type. There are two types of displays. The first is an active matrix or a TFT and the second is a passive matrix. The active matrix will give you brighter graphics, more fluid motion if you're using programs with video or, or more graphic intensive programs, um, but they will cost a lot more money. And the sixth consideration is durability. If you're very active in using your laptop and you're prone to dropping it, you may want to pay the extra money to get a uh, shock resistant hard drive or perhaps a hardened enclosure so that you're not prone to damaging it and, and costing a lot of money to repair it. Um, and these are the six questions I would ask myself before purchasing a laptop. My name is Chris Dowdy with Orange Star Networks.